The top comes with a collar that goes from the shoulder to the upper bust. So here I've cut the collar out. Two pieces. What I'm going to do is I'm going to stitch seam allowance all the way down from one end to the next end all the way down. Once I'm done doing that, I'm just going to go ahead and fold the collar over and this will be the collar. So I'm going to go ahead now and just stitch the seam allowance all the way down for the collar. Here we have the front section of the top. There is a liner piece that goes on the armhole. I'm just going to pin it all the way around and I'm just going to uh, flat stitch down. Put some notches in the shoulders and then flip it over. There's also a dart that I'm going to place a half inch dart on the side of the top. Also there is another liner that goes to the front section of the top. It's not going to be this long, probably going to take off two inches from the length of this. And I'm just going to go ahead, line it up with the salvage edge. And I'm going to go ahead and flat stitch up to the length that I'm going to stop at. Once I flat stitch that down, I'm going to flip it over. I'm just going to go ahead and flip it over and this is how it's going to be. Actually this liner is just the backing and support for the buttons or the buttonhole. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. I'm going to go ahead and stitch the dart. I'm going to stitch the liner and I'm also going to stitch the backing support. Also, this is what the armhole and the darts look like after I've lined it. So now we're going to work with the color. This is the color. The color is going to go alongside the neckline. So this is where the color is going to be placed. So I'm going to go ahead now, stitch seam allowance all the way from the shoulders to the end of the neckline. I'm just going to go ahead and stitch it and then I'm going to just search the edges. After I'm done stitching the color, I'm going to place the liner and I'm going to go ahead and stitch seam allowance from here to the end. So once again, I'm going to go ahead, stitch the color, stitch the sides of the liner all the way down, seam allowance, and I'm just going to go ahead and search from the shoulder all the way down here. So here we have the top, the color sewn on. This is the armhole liner and the dart. And I also place the side liner under the collar. So this will be this is the front of the top. The quarter section of the front 
This front has two pieces. This is the second piece. I'm going to place a liner on the armhole. Flat stitch, fold over and flat stitch again. And I'm also going to place a liner to the front opening of this. I'm just going to go ahead either place a liner or flat stitch it down. And here we have the second half of the front. The dart is sewn, the armhole is lined, and the front is lined. So this is the front half of the top. Here we have the back section of the top. It's cut in a fold. I also place a liner onto the back. So I'm just going to go ahead and stitch the neckline and I'm going to also stitch the armhole. So I'm going to align I'm going to align the neck armhole and I'm also going to align the neckline. The shoulders I'm leaving because I'm going to join the shoulders to the front two-piece section. So once again, this is the back cut on a fold. I'm going to line the neckline. I'm going to line the armhole. Here I pin the shoulders, half in seam allowance. So I'm just going to go ahead and stitch the shoulders. This is the front and back joined together. So I'm just going to go ahead and stitch this down. Also, I pinned the side of the top, half in seam allowance. So I'm just going to go ahead and stitch all this all the way down from under the shoulder armhole to the waist. So I'm going to go ahead and do that then I'm just gonna go ahead and hem a basic hem um, half inch fold it twice and I'm just gonna go ahead and flat stitch it all the way down so I'm gonna hem the blouse I'm gonna stitch the sides uh, I'm gonna stitch the shoulders so I'm gonna go ahead and do that now so here's join the sides and I'll hem the top. So this is what it looks like when I'm done. This is and this is the front and the strap. So this is what it looks like. 